as you with my witch eyes. Oh boy. Bam. Look into my eyes. Look me in the eyes. Look me in the eyes and tell me you don't find me attractive. Look me in the eyes. <laughs> And there I go. We're like floof it. Like I got the floof. <laughs> get the floof. I got that floof. Alright, we don't have much time. Do Only you two got batteries. That, do you got that floof? Only two bars. <laughs> Hello and welcome to Thesis Check In Sick Edition Part Two. Oh wow! <laughs> How long did you work on that? Years. Um, is ill, everyone. I'm ill. I'm actually a lot better now, thanks to the care of Jenna and Vanessa. Oh, I so had Vanessa. a really bad flu. Um, the influenza. I had the influenza. It's true. Um, but yeah, I got it after I got back from Utah, which was really fun. And I have a great vlog that you guys should all check out if you want to watch my. Um, a lot of poor decision making. Never ending poor decision and failures. <laughs> so um, yeah. So yeah, that's why I'm kind of like half done today. I was like, I'm just gonna do my eyes and call it a day. <laughs> um, yeah, we're lipstick free. Mm -hmm. Still cute. Jump right into yeah. what we did this Get week. Going. I I'm feeling a little stressed right now because I'm kind of behind. I had like a plan this week for what I wanted to get done, um, which obviously kind of went out the window when I had a fever on Tuesday and I couldn't really do much um, so I'm feeling a lot of pressure with that and I have so much work to make up from this week not just in um, thesis but in my ULEC as well um, ULEC being my lecture. university lecture yeah um, I forget that people don't know what we're talking about sometimes um, so yeah I'm definitely feeling the pressure with that a bit but um, I think that I think I should like kind of you know still have faith in myself because I think I'm still in a really good place personally I just didn't get as much done this week as I was hoping to but um, it'll look like a lot to the viewers because I have stuff from like last week to show too what did you do this week well uh, one of my machines broke it's so mm. sad mm. the saddest story truly um, so I kind of had to pivot a little bit pivot what a fun buzzword yeah, so I had to figure out something else. So, um, showed Marissa, and then also Nicole. Hey, thanks, Nicole. Um, who you will meet in a separate video about this event. But, um, showed them how to hand knit. And, you know, we had some adventures. We had some trials and tribulations, <laughs> truly. Um, yeah, it's true. But, yeah, so I'm doing that instead of using the one machine. And then, um... You know, we have some fun stuff here. Um, this this tank top, which was made before the machine broke, which you can see George in, in his vlog. Oh, I'm so excited so to watch cute. George. I love him so, so much. Hi, George. We had some good times. Also some trials and tribulations. George, I miss you. You know, it's... Did they come back? It's good that he made it, because he got lost when he was by himself momentarily. What? So it was real touch and go there. <coughs> um, of course he did. And then there's a pattern for that tank, and then Megan, you will be very happy that there is a pattern for your legs. I don't have to make a pattern, everybody! Woo! Woo! Oh, Honestly, the greatest gift that I could have I ever received. I don't think any of it's showing up, but it is there. I'm Listen, sure. they can see that general shape. It's fine. So, I'm gonna go to my studio after we film this, and I'm gonna crank out a sample of it. I just don't know. Mm -hmm. How it's gonna turn out, but we'll see. I'm sure it'll be fine. Yep. Um, and then I have a little printout on how to draft some socks, so maybe I'll get around to that. But that might some be sucky. next week. And yeah. Oh, and I made this other little hand knit sample too, just so people. Could oh yeah, this other small, you know, just a small little hand knit it's sample. It's like a little cardigan thing. I don't know. It's. Here, we'll just all pop it on. I just pumped out this massive, like, vest I mean, sample. I mean, look, it's very bulky, so it grew very quickly. Oh, love this color scheme together, but yeah, oh. Ooh, oh, colors show really good day. on the camera here, though. Yeah, so vibrant. So, anyway, this is, like, to show Marissa and then Nicole. But, anyway, so, view that. That's what I did. Nicole might lose her mind when she sees it. I'm getting it. the machine fixed on the 8th. Which oh, yay. Like, two weeks, which is a very long time in, like, thesis world. It's true. It's world? Answer me this. Anyway. Did this week. Um, 
Hmm. Well, let's kind of start off with what I did. Blow me away, Megan. Oh no, I can't pick it up. Okay. Blowing you away! Oh, that was a little bit delayed. Wait, here. Well, the first thing I did is I fixed my um, layout and color scheme, and it looks much more cohesive and organized. I don't know if it'll... Oh, yeah, it shows up. It's pretty good. Um, on here. Woo! So I did that. Um, I'm still working on it a little bit, but I'm really excited with how it's looking, and I've gotten a lot of positive feedback in critiques recently, and I'm just feeling full steam ahead. So I'm ready to go. Um, and then I also, oh no, the title is crooked. Let me just fix that on up. Oof. Perfectionist. Before she reveals it. Um, so I also have my Fit Binder. Oh, I actually well. can't remember if we talked about this or not. Yeah, we did. We did? Because I had to do one of those ones. Oh, that's right, but did I show mine? No, you did not show mine. No, I did not show mine. Okay, so this is my Fit Binder. Ta da! Um, on the cover, I have Henry's Storybook from Once Upon a Time. Um, I mean, it was fitting, and it like also just kind of reminds me to always kind of stay in my own little fairy tale world. It's uh, nice and thick, as you can see. Um, I'm okay. Well, there's just two purse clips that have escaped. Off they go. Um, so yes, so as you can see, very organized. We start off, and we have the tab mm. labeling the collection mm. area. So this is Woods Look Number One. I love that tab. Then we have uh, the sketch Ooh. with the swatches. Then we have all of the photos mm -hmm. of the model mm -hmm. beautifully presented to mm -hmm. you here. Mm -hmm. And then we have this nice little folder, which is low velcro opening with the pattern. Mm -hmm. I'm really proud of this binder. Oh, wow. Lighting change. Hello. Okay. Um, and then, yeah, same with all the looks. We have, oh, that changed. Oh, no, that's the same. Um, and then we have, yeah, so that's pretty much what it looks like for all of them. Um, and then, you know, there's just, I like took the time to cut out all the background so it's like just the garment that you can see. And then, it's important, folks. Like the fun pictures of Jenna. Hey. So cute. Um, so, yeah, so I finished my Fit Finder and I'm really proud and excited about it. Um, it's going to have to be super organized. Now. It really is. It's actually really, really nice. Um, I might actually have to get a bigger binder because it's like gotten to the point where like when I try and unclip it, like everything kind of falls off. Uh, uh, the only thing I have left to do are flats, which I've been kind of avoiding because I hate flats and they're so like time It's not that I hate them like they're really helpful But it's just they're really time-consuming even though my look my looks are like there's not none of my looks except for one of them are really complicated So the flats are gonna be and the flats are literally like what they sound like they are drawings of the garment mm -hmm. flat Yeah, I think we've explained them once before but it's probably gonna be do it again. Yeah, I don't know them um, I also don't know why we both decided to dress so autumnal today, seeing as it's basically spring in New York right now. Oh, it's, it's like chilly again. You know, oh, it's it is. Yeah, my name is my buffer. What? Yeah, it's cold. It was like 76 yesterday. It's very cold now. I only had my leather jacket on, and it was real chilly out there when I got the start. Oh, okay, well that's wild. Um, all right, but the exciting news is when I was in Utah, my mom. Um, I think I talked about this a little bit. Yeah, I talked about this in one of my vlogs. Yeah forever ago, but my mom was one of the people who helped teach me how to sew, and like when she was younger, she like sewed all of her own clothes, and so she is really good at sewing and problem solving, and she's also like really interested in like helping me in any way that she can, and helping like consult me, um, and my mother, good old Judy, like my mom, my mama, mama, hey mommy, um, she helped me fix my cape pattern, and my cape is finished, woohoo! It's so beautiful, and it even has a little bow on it. Here, I'll put it on right now for all our Please viewers. Do. Please do. Um, so yeah, we it took a lot of trial and error. Okay. I'm sorry. That's fine. It took a lot of trial and error. I'm not gonna lie. Um, about had some good times. Yeah. Um, trying to fix it, and it's bow there, so nice, works so beautifully. And then for the grand reveal. Ooh, we are We're just really playing up this. French accent. Today. Listen, I'm just really excited for Beauty and the Beast. I don't know what to tell you. Oh boy. We Why have. Bye! <laughs> oh my god. It's so beautiful. That's good. You disappeared. Oh, it's well, a little. <laughs> Alright, well, that was a little. little was it cool. too sad? Was it too sad? A little bit. Oh, um, I'm so sorry. I was more talking about not getting sick. Bye. If you do, I got some good Tammy flu. 
I honestly, whoo, Tammy Flu. I'm a real proponent of I'm Tammy a real Flu. Proponent of Tammy Flu. Like, y'all, it was a rough on t Wednesday. Real rough. I honestly kind of like don't remember anything that happened Wednesday morning. Like, I remember Vanessa walking in, and then like I kind of remember calling healthcare. Okay, can we also talk about the video that you made? Oh yeah, it's beautiful. Oh, it's so good. It's its own video. Enjoy. Yep. In the height of my flu riddenness. It's cute. I was like, you know, this will probably be really funny content. It's like it's really informative. I feel. Yeah. I learned a lot. Yep. You know. I mean, I'm just a natural born knitter. Yeah, she's really. Oof, wow, her technique. Yeah. Unparalleled, truly. But back to my cape. So sorry. Yes, the cape. My cape is all done. Look at this fancy hood. Ooh. Whoa! I blended to the wall. <laughs> Look! I, I see that. It doubles as an invisibility cloak. Harry! <laughs> Harry, where are you? Harry, I can't see you! Ooh. Wait, oh my god, wait! No, it is. It wait. Is. You really do disappear. <laughs> I wonder Here what I, I am! Cool. I wonder what the lighting's gonna look like. Here I am! Here I am! It probably Jump will. scare. <laughs> <laughs> Jump scare. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, <George. coughs> um, But yeah, so that is. I should probably take this off because I kind of blended to the wall. Yeah, just a tad. Um, but yeah, so that's my cape that I finished. Um, and today I'm going to try and do my pants so that I have like um, two complete looks to fit because I have this and then the dress to fit underneath it ready. And then I have the top. Ugh, I just need to bite the bullet and sew it. Um, Truly, Megan. Because the top's just done. I just need to sew it. Um, so I'll work on that today. And yeah, that's about it for me. Maybe if I have time, I'm going to try and dye my hair because it's getting real, real rough up in here, ladies and gentlemen. It's like all different kinds Truly of well real right. rustic orange and kind of like root action going on. Yeah. You know when I was home, my mom was like, Megan, are you sure you want to make me a like, hair appointment for you? <laughs> And I was like, subtle, Judy. It's like subtle, mom. Thanks. So yeah. Get that good Oscars are tonight. Really excited. Um, I'm excited for the amount of like diversity that is being featured this year as well, um, and the amount of like talent that I think is there. That's like a lot of new talent that I'm really excited is being recognized. Um, Obviously, I'm a big fan of a La La Land, so, I mean, I don't really, I honestly don't think that I have to wish it luck. Like, I don't think, I think it's probably going to do fine. I think, you know, it'll probably win a lot of awards, but, um, you know, so I'm just going to go ahead and say congratulations, Emma Stone! You never know, it could be a real upset. Yeah, that actually could be really cool. Like, how amazing would that be if it won, like, Everything no awards? Really like, everyone would be like, La La Land wins zero awards! It could happen. It could. I doubt it, but it yeah, might. I also doubt it, but I mean, oof, wow. Wouldn't yeah. that make for a great water cooler talk on Monday? <laughs> it really would. That'd be so shocking. After it won, like, all of the Golden Globe Awards, just come to the Oscars, the Oscars. and get nothing. Yep. Oh, but I am excited because Sarah Bareilles is about to get her performance EGOT because she's getting stuff done. Yes. For those of you that don't know, a performance EGOT is when you've performed at the Emmys the Grammys, the Oscars, and the Tonys. It's true. A performance EGOT, which is like a very difficult thing to do, I imagine. Um, Good job, Sarah. I'm excited. Well, no, is there anything you're excited for this week? I am excited to watch all the new episodes of My Brother, My Brother, and Me on CISO TV. That's right. The wild boys have become the cops. Part car, part boy, boy car, the protector and king of Philadelphia. New Duckburg, come out and play! Where do I watch them? On CISO. How do I get CISO? I don't know. I think I'm gonna have to get a subscription. Can I watch it with you? Oh, oh no. Don't think the microphone's gonna pick that up. Can I watch it with you? Sure. Yay. The battery's flashing! Yeah. Oh. Yeah, we got it. And oh my gosh, because we still have to do our thumbnail. Okay, well, we'll see you next week, guys. Bye! Thanks for watching.